Next we have James Payne from Henderson County in District 2. Every Sunday my family and I wake up bright and early, get dressed, and head to town for church. I enter through the doors and am immediately handed the weekly church bulletin. While I sit in my pew surrounded by the beautiful stained glass, I open the bulletin where a preview of the week's message is written. I distinctly remember reading the title of a particular month-long preaching series, Farming, It Isn't for the Faint of Heart. This particularly struck my interest because of my passion and involvement in agriculture. I've grown up around farming and currently serve as the Henderson County FFA president, which has greatly increased my knowledge and appreciation for agriculture. As Father Carl gave his homily, he told stories of the struggles they had, growing up on a family farm, milking dairy cattle, and raising tobacco, and how faith in God helped to overcome that. In the weeks following the preaching series, more and more struggles facing farmers came to my attention, especially after attending an event in which Kentucky State Representative Suzanne Miles and Kentucky State Senator Paul Hornback, farmer and chair of the Agriculture Session Committee, spoke on legislation being questioned in Congress that would greatly benefit our farmers concerning animal rights and tobacco funding. The Farm Bill, advocated by Farm Bureau, has also seen several bumps in the road gathering support. The list goes on, but the fact of the matter is, farming is the most important industry of our world and must be protected. It is crucial that groups such as the National FFA Organization and Farm Bureau continue to advocate in safeguarding farmers' rights and therefore agriculture as a whole. Farming is a diminishing occupation. It isn't for the faint of heart, but for the strong-willed and determined soul. So please advocate what puts safe, edible food on our tables. Thank you.